Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to install the shaders mod for Minecraft 1.8. Now, what this mod does is adds in shaders into your Minecraft game. So, as you can see here, like shadows and sunsets, uh, you can also just read about it here and it uh, tells you all this stuff about it. Um, but yeah, uh, also this is very intensive on your computer, so make sure you have a pretty good computer uh, before uh, getting this mod. Also, you can get like a lagless shader pack and uh, that helps. Uh, but yeah, if we scroll down to the bottom, as you can see, uh, this version for 1.8 is not compatible with Optifine and Forge Mod Loader. So just keep that in mind, you won't be able to install Optifine with it and uh, it doesn't work with Mod Loader. So now what you're going to do to install the mod is visit the description and under downloads there will be two links, you want to click on both. The first one is going to take you to add focus and uh, you just want to click skip after it's been five seconds. And uh, that's going to take you here, and you just want to click download. Uh, so once you've got that file, uh, that's the only thing you need, uh, but you do need WinRAR to open the file. So make sure you go to the second link and download this program. You can also get 7-zip, so just uh, click the version for your computer here, and, and then just install it. So once you've got that, you want to get this file and drag it to the desktop, just like that. So just shaders mod 1.8, and uh, once you've got that on the desktop, you can close this. And uh, now what you want to do uh, for the mod, uh, considering it's for 1.8, you have to run the 1.8 version at least once. So to do that, run Minecraft, then click New Profile, and uh, just call it 1.8, or it doesn't even matter, you're going to delete this profile anyway, so just, uh, yeah, you can name it whatever you want. Then you want to click this arrow and tick Release 1.8, so tick that save and then select it and press play. Okay so once it's done you can quit the game and uh, now you've done that you want to right click on this shaders mod 1.8 just right click on it open with WinRAR and uh, if it doesn't show up here that means you haven't got it so make sure you do get that so click on that drag it to the side and you want to get this file here and just drag that to the desktop uh, preferably just near it and uh, once you've done that, you can minimize this, and now what you want to do with this file is right click on it, open with Java, and this is basically a installer, so you just want to click yes, uh, that just saying you need to make sure that Minecraft is closed, so close it, and then press yes, and uh, then press ok, and uh, then it's going to say complete, and you just want to press ok. So once you've done that, we've installed the GLS L shaders mod. Uh, so you can delete this and now we have to install the shader packs. So how you want to do that is press the Windows key and R at the same time and that's going to bring up this run thing and basically here you just want to type in percentage app data percentage so just type that in and then press OK. Once you've done that you're going to be taken here to your roaming folder and you just want to look for a file named .minecraft so just go to that and now what you want to do is uh, go back to the WinRAR file we opened before and you want to get the shader packs folder and drag it into your .minecraft. Just like that, uh, so now that you've done that you've installed the mod so you can delete this and uh, then just open Minecraft. And I hope that wasn't too hard, uh, I did make it pretty easy by just putting it all in one file uh, so I hope it worked uh, but now what you want to do is go to the profile editor and you want to right click on this 1.8 version as uh, this is just the useless version we made to install the mod so just right click on it delete delete and uh, once you've done that to run the mod you just select it and press play okay so now if you go to options and then shaders as you can see all the ones I have added are here uh, also if you do have any you know specific shader pack you want me to add please just let me know and I'll add it to the pack uh, I'm pretty sure I do have everyone apart from a uh, wavy plants or something that didn't work uh, but yeah uh, this should be enough for you as you can see you can just choose which one you want uh, so I'm just going to tick the lagless shader pack and uh, once you've done that you just select it and then just make a world and uh, as you can see it works you can see all the shaders here so yeah that's how you know it works uh, if it didn't for any reason please leave a comment and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible and uh, yeah if you like this video please give it a like and subscribe if you're new and I'll see you all